Okay, it's March 4th, 2016. It's Parker's birthday. It's his 17th birthday. I am in the pickup, the truck. You may recognize the nice interior. The window operating. And Parker's 17 today. Happy birthday, birthday boy. Gracias. So how does it feel to be big and driving and doing the speed limit stuff? Normal day. Just another day closer to death. You know. Another day? Come on. Be a little more positive than that. It's cool, I guess. I mean, I'm 17. You know, just chilling. 17, chilling, doing your thing. You got big plans for tonight? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Do I need to know? No, you do not. <laughs> it's all good, though. You're worrying me. Mom said the same thing. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Well, that's just what parents do, man. I understand. I haven't gone to jail yet, so it's all good. And we don't want you to go to jail. <laughs> I can no actually jail. go to big people jail now, right, Dad? Big people jail. You're 17. You go to big people jail. If you do dumb with capital D-U-M, you go to big people jail. And don't run over these construction workers, please. Well, everybody's been asking, how's Parker, how's Parker, how's Parker, and I've not been able to... Um, That's can you... Mark it down. <laughs> okay. We're good. It's all good. Everybody's been asking, how's Parker? And I've been putting it off and putting it off and putting it off, so how is Parker? I'm good now. Just living with Dad past, what, four months-ish? Yeah, four, like that. four or five months, something like that. So, doing that, got a job, about to quit that one, get a new one, because I hate the one I'm at right now. Oh, yeah? Yeah, oh, yeah. Move up in the world? Yeah, little by little. Just, well, I'll, I'll, people, they want to know a little more than that. I mean, <laughs> the hair's still long. The hair's still long. Just doing my deal. Okay. No, you're fine. This is this is it. Oh, okay. We're headed up to the P.O. box. So, what are your plans? How do you enjoy living in the RV park? It's chill. Talk one's, to me, Goose. Everyone's nice there. You don't have to have a big old fight every time you get home. You know, the old routine. It's kind of still getting used to not yelling at somebody every day which is good saving my voice okay um i'm just chilling hanging out okay well you've obviously received a lot of support from a lot of people yeah either really young people or people my age ish with people your age as kids right what do you have i mean what do you how do you feel about that We've talked about it, it a little bit. Man, don't hit those dogs. Oh, jeez, Louise. Oh, that's a puppy. Oh, I would for sure go to hell if I hit a puppy. <laughs> um, the support I've gotten via, you know, message on Dad's Facebook or the Parker page or uh, even letters sent out to us, uh, that helped me a lot when I was going through what I was going through. And um, make me nervous. But we're not going 80 now, we're going 40. I know, but I'm old. Yeah, you're getting there. Um, but that helped me out a lot, knowing that, you know, I've, people were telling me, you know, certain family members of mine that I was going off the rocker, I was insane, I was, you know, making this stuff up. And, I, you know, whenever they would say that, you know, coming from your family, you know, you kind of stop and think, like, am I, am I going insane? Am I making a big deal out of nothing? Yeah. And for people to... Are you kidding me right now, lady? Wow. I'll even give you props. That was not your fault. This time. <laughs> um, but to have other people from across the country and even 
across the world saying, hey, you know, you're not alone. You're not, you know, losing your head or anything. Like, I'm going through the same thing or my kids are going through the same thing. You know, you know, we're here for you, you know, whatever. Contact me at this number or via email or whatever. And I haven't even read all of them. Dad's read more than I have just because, you know, it's, it's kind of hard to keep up with all of the things that come in. Is that it? Yeah, you can turn around up here. It's no big deal. But, uh, so yeah, that's it for the, as far as support goes. It helped me out a lot whenever I was going through that. Do you have any regrets? Oh, no. No. I get that a lot, too. No, What's I don't that? regret anything. Do I have regrets? No, not one. I don't regret anything. Okay. Well, uh, for other people who've been in your shoes, would you, I mean... Obviously, I went to jail right. for 60 days. I mean, would you? Wouldn't hang it right. You were right. Yeah. Um, you know, that was tough for me. Yeah. And, and other people have faced that. Um, would you suggest other people do this? Or what we um, did as far as recording and. Yeah. I mean, and there's no wrong answer. I, I swear, there's. It, it's hard. I mean, yeah. Hey, yeah. I'm so glad you went to jail, Dad. Thanks for doing it. I mean, no. I mean, I I'm, get it. I'm not taking it like that. I'm just like. I mean, if you wanna. I mean, it's gonna suck if you do it. Because you know, like Dad said, going to jail is not fun. I haven't been to jail yet. Hopefully, you're, never. You're, yeah. Don't go to jail, or it's not. But. It's, I mean, it's gonna, it's gonna suck until, you know, two or three years down the line, it finally pays off, if it ever will, but if you, if it's that important to you, yeah, I'd say go for it, I mean, it's your life, or it's your, you know, your son's and daughter's life, or whatever your situation may be, like, just because one person thinks that they have control over you, just because what the courts say that is not true at all like this is your life you're running the show you're in the driver's seat either put it in gear or you don't like this is your call and don't let anyone else tell you otherwise because it's not their life so it's not their place yeah hang a left here oh i thought we were going straight yeah over the railroad track oh, yeah. okay well i guess you want to give a plug for mud jug yeah if i can get sponsored by mud jug um that'd be great well right now he's spitting in an old bottle so i'm sure i'm gonna get all kinds of grief for uh 17 years old dipping um okay. no that's not the point i I'm mean ju i'm just kidding i wish you wouldn't you. do it but I've realized a long time ago there's certain things you're just gonna do and there's nothing I can do about it. Okay. Well, like I said, everybody just wanted a, an update and I've been putting it off. Uh, is there anything, I'm gonna have to end this unless there's something else anybody you wanna shout out to or say hello to or whatever. Um, I guess I would say, uh, you know, obviously shout out to everyone who has contacted either me or dad throughout the years and you know kind of kept up with our content and written or you know commented or anything like that but uh yeah that's that's about it it's your life you choose the way you want to do it don't let anyone else tell you otherwise you want long hair grow your hair out you want to you know do things that are against the rules or you're going to hell if you do that um do it if you want to do it it's not anyone else's business really what you're doing with your own life because it's your life and you just better not hurt anybody doing it no because you're mean, big I don't, I don't think anyone who keeps up with our content is gonna <laughs> like go out and do something like that dad well good because as big as you are six foot one Bigger than me, I'll still put the hurt on you. Oh, I believe it. <laughs> I right, love you, buddy. Love you, do that.